What's good guys, it's Nick's Lotus with a split second deck tech just for you. Today we've got Gearson Star and Keller Morph. If you like running pingers and turning a nickel and dime strategy up to a dime and quarter type shit, or you just want to be a space cowboy, this guy is for you. Profession was... Oh, space cowboy! Correct! This deck is based around running those classic deal one damage pingers like Prodigal Sorcerer or Cunning Spark Mage and turning them into lightning bolts on sticks. Anyway, I started blasting. Bam! which in itself becomes pretty solid spot removal. As far as card draw goes, the classics like Brainstorm and Mindspring are always going to be good, but cards like Curiosity and Ophidian Eye turn your pingers into card draw as well. In this deck, we don't need as much removal because our pingers are going to be able to handle most creatures, each dealing three damage. Cards like Blazing Volley and End the Festivities become pseudo board wipes for the deck, saving us space for more deal damage type shit. Just like, funnily enough, a card I brought up in my five commons to running commander video, which you can find right above right there, Kezig Fire Breather. It's super solid in this deck. It turns all of our non-creatures into three damage to each opponent, which is just insane. Or maybe you like the idea of running cards like Cattle Trops or Aether Sting to make your opponents get bolted for just playing the game. Cards like Repercussion turn all your creature removal into damage to the opponent. And of course, with all this tapping, a thousand year elixir is a must in this deck. Now, I've heard a lot of people talk about running the untapped creatures in here, like Kelpie Guide, but we could just replace it with another pinger, so I really don't see the point in running those type of cards in this deck. Again, this deck is highly efficient at saving up space. The remo Removal, the board wipe, and the mana ramp slots are all pretty much getting filled up by the pingers. The pingers are really cheaply costed, leading us to having to not run as much mana ramp. The pingers act as removal and board wipes, leaving us to not have to run as many of those two things, saving a spot. This deck can get away with running 25 to 30 pingers easily with all those slots open, making it very efficient. If you've always wanted to run an Izzy deck that just wasn't spell slinger strictly, or have been looking for a deck to put all those pingers into, Gearson seems like your guy. Hope you enjoyed the deck. Much love, guys. Go play some magic. This world flawed. Look at the hate they keep sending me. And not to mention the lack of remembering. And not to mention a happy good memory. And not to mention the friends that don't rest in peace. And not to mention the demons that get in me.